the trust is crucial. Yeah. Having a structure in your school, you have to develop a structure that develops trust amongst people. And this yeah. is where the mainstream schooling tends to fall down. Yeah. And, and where teachers do things they don't realize are problematic. And this is why it's so inconsistent mm -hmm. in mainstream schools is that the, the quality of any given classroom is, is super different. Every classroom within a school is mm -hmm. going to be very different because the hazards of that power of, mm -hmm. the, of the teacher is, is built on trust. Is well, there's no integrity. If there's no integrity, children pick up on lack of integrity, just like I, I'm not. I'm not even talking about integrity. integrity. But just, it, just it, like you know, being a word, this person will keep you safe. No, they can't. Well, or whatever. Children, they pick up on that so quickly. I would say it's not integrity because even the most uh, teachers who intend the best, you know, like they may have great intentions, and they may yeah. be doing their best to fulfill those intentions. But when the power structure is is created in such a way that, that the yeah. teacher's ability to build to trust can be yeah. undermined by other people, yeah. other people yeah. in the same classroom yeah. can yeah. undermine yeah. their thing. So it's not but their that's integrity. What I mean by integrity. Well, it's not that it's not theirs, but it is a kind of integrity in the sense that it, if they say this is what's going to happen or I promise this and that. And then a week later, they say, I'm sorry, but Miss, Miss So-and-so says, no, that's not allowed. And right. we've got to right. follow the rules and so on like that. And then. Quite quickly, the, the, the sort of the sort of level of resignation. Exactly, exactly. It's, it's just you know, I noticed this. I know I was teaching first year secondary school as part of my teacher training, and the the level of resignation and cynicism. And I just thought, there's nothing I can do about that. Right. They know exactly how the system works, and they're going to play the system, and they they know that this is there's absolute power, and they have to just do as they're told. That's right. But there's no joy. As soon as you try and introduce, oh, let's do something that you want to do, they're like. What do you want me to say? They feel manipulated by it, yeah. This is the Agentic Schools Podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg.